Welcome to Troops Tracks. Chris Dawson here. Well, the North Bay Centennials have been gone since, can you believe it, 2002. But did you know that there's still two former Centennials that are still lighting it up in the National Hockey League? Chris Neal has come a long way. The former North Bay Centennial eclipsed the 1,000 game mark in the National Hockey League in the fall of 2016. The Flesherton, Ontario product had two 26-goal seasons for the Sense back in the late 1990s. Neil saw North Bay come back into his hockey life late last season as he teamed up on a line with former North Bay Battalion star Nick Paul. Despite the time away from North Bay, the Sense name and the Northern community will always remain close to his heart. Well, obviously it's great to see. Uh, I love North Bay. It's there my whole uh, OHL career and uh, just a great city and great fan base. And uh, I, you can't say enough about the city. And uh, obviously uh, I was devastated when they lost their team. But now that uh, they got one back, it's great to, great to see. And uh, still producing uh, some great uh, young prospects. Well, he's been around a long time and, and he's lo he lasted a uh, very long time the hard way. So he knows to do all the little things right. He knows what it takes every day to be a pro. And I got so many memories of Chris Neal, like believe it or not, as, as a younger guy, and I think he's only a year older than I am, but still you look up to those guys, and uh, he had a great little sports car. Uh, it's funny, the, the things that you remember. I remember lots of fights with Luch Nisato. Uh, I remember lots of goals. I remember driving by Meaford, Ontario all the time on the way to Owen Sound, and everyone kind of poking fun at Nealer because that's where he's from, and you know, we'd talk about cow tipping, wherever it was, and of course he got the last laugh. Chris Thorburn is the other North Bay Centennial still playing in the National Hockey League. Thorburn was here in the final Centennial season as he moved with the team to Saginaw in 2002. Drafted by the Buffalo Sabres in 2001, Thorburn has also worked hard to etch out a solid NHL career. He has also made an NHL franchise move, moving with the Atlanta Thrashers organization to Winnipeg. The Sault Ste. Marie native also played once again in North Bay during the Hockeyville game in 2007 and is now closing in on 800 games in the NHL. Good afternoon, this is Steve Harlan with Troops Tracks. I'm here with some of our favorite battalions. Here personally is my second least favorite, Zach Poirier. Now we're going around asking people their New Year's resolutions or New Year's resolutions for other people. Now, Zachary, what is your New Year's resolution? or for someone else? Uh, I think I have a good uh, New Year's resolution for Reese Forehan and uh, that would be to stop eating so many cheeseburgers on game days. Oh, that does make a lot of sense. I agree with that. Hello back again. We're here with my fifth least favorite battalion now, Brady Lyle. Now Brady, do you have any New Year's resolutions for yourself or anyone else? Uh, for me, I think my New Year's resolution would to uh, become the best Call of Duty player on the team. You know, that's kind of been a big goal of mine and uh, hopefully I can achieve it soon. I agree. I don't think it will happen anytime soon, but thank you very much, Brady. All right, we're back with the third question, and I'm here with Zach Stinkar, and we're asking people questions. What are their New Year's resolutions or other people's? Now, Zach, what is yours? Uh, my New Year's resolution is to be in as good shape as Coach John Dean. I agree. He is in very good shape. Now, thank you for joining Troops Tracks, and enjoy the game. That's it for Troops Tracks with a little Sense Tracks flavor to it again this week. We'll see you again real soon.